Once your clay turns the leather hard, then you can flip it over, pull out the drape mold, and then peel out the doily. Then carefully place your clay back onto the drape mold. When trimming your bowl, it's best to put it on a turntable so that you can easily guide a blade all the way around. You'll set it on there, hold the blade in one hand, and rotate your clay with the other hand, trying to keep the blade at an even level all the way around. After you've got a clean cut all the way around, you can then remove the excess clay. To make the edges more smooth, take a damp sponge and wipe around the rim of the bowl. Now take two pieces of clay and roll into balls. When figuring out where your feet are gonna go on the bottom of the bowl, think of a triangle where three points will be centered on the bottom of your bowl. Make sure these dots are equally spread apart. Then you will cut each ball in half. After you've cut them, score each piece. Then be sure to score the points that you made on the bottom of your bowl. Then apply the slip and press the pieces on the marked areas of the bottom of your bowl. While the slip is still wet, make sure that the, the feet are placed equally apart and centered on the bottom of your bowl. Once the feet are attached, flip the bowl over and gently press down. This will secure the feet onto the bowl and it will also flatten the feet out so that it sits evenly on a table surface.